And today, as we open the 23rd session of the JCCT, our two-way trade in goods has grown to over $500 billion. We are now the two largest economies in the world, and our relationship, particularly our trade and commerce relationship, has never been more important. The JCCT has been important in this growth. To the distinguished Vice Premier, Honorable Ministers. This is an historic time for both of our countries, as the elevation of China's new leadership and the re-election of President Obama coincide. We're entering a unique moment in which we can work together to ensure a healthy long-term and short-term growth of our relationship. Among the uncertainties, what is certain is that the sluggish economic situation will continue for a long time to come. To ensure growth, employment and stability is still the number one task for all countries. China is the largest developing country in the world, and the United States the largest developed one. A stronger economic and trade cooperation will be critical to the economy of the two countries and the economy of the whole world. At this meeting, the two sides need to implement the agreement reached between the leaders of the two countries in real earnest, exchange ideas in with candor and in-depth on issues of each other's concern, deepen cooperation in various fields and send a positive signal to the outside. Now we will begin with our meeting discussions. I would invite representatives.